Hello. Hi guys. Today, instead of wine and crafts, we're doing caffeine and crafts. <laughs> uh, it's a really beautiful spring day, so we figured we would come outside for our craft project today, since it's inspired by spring. Um, so we are going to do watercolor painting of fabric. So I'm going to do a pillowcase. And I'm doing a canvas bag. Um, so what we'll do is we're first going to get our uh, material wet and then we'll start painting. Step one, open your box. <laughs> See you in a bit. <laughs> so uh, Nicola and I are trying different approaches so we can decide what's best. I'm using liquid watercolor and she's using, using the watercolor cakes. So the example that we kind of referenced used the cakes, and I thought since it's already, I don't know, I just figured I might as well try this. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Um, outside of the watercolor cakes, you'll also need um, a fabric medium, which basically you add to the water, um, so that way when you uh, paint your watercolor, it'll actually will paint to the fabric. Right, and it sticks. So I, when she was telling me this, I was thinking, wouldn't it just wash out? And the fabric medium is what keeps it in. Um, so we have two cups of water. This one is just going to be for painting. And this one is what we're going to put the fabric medium in so that we can like do that. Are we doing the fabric medium first? Or? Yeah, you have to put it in the... How much do you do? We're kind of winging it. The thing said like two to one for the paint. When you pick up your brush, you would add it to the paint, the medium, and then into your color, and then paint on, so that way the medium's a part of the paint. And then at the very end, you're gonna paint the whole thing with the medium to keep it kind of like locked in. We got this. What could go wrong? Ooh, that looks really pretty already. <laughs> Done like one thing. <laughs> <laughs> watercolor if you're gonna use the liquid is that um, it's highly pigment pigmented but it's meant to be diluted by water so I'm like not using very much but I'm gonna I'm not using very much but I'm going to dilute it with water and then it'll turn into like a lot more Originally, also figuring out if my watercolor was going to bleed onto oh, yeah. the back of my pillow, and it looks like it does a little bit, um, which isn't actually a bad thing. Um, if you wanted two different patterns, um, kind of tie dye -ish. you can, yeah, like I think it's one of those things where it's like if you want two different kind of patterns, you'd want to put something in between or wait to sew it. So you cut your squares, do the painting, and then sew them together. Um, but I'm actually okay with it because for what I'm doing, it's kind of more of a tie-dye, fl free-flowing color, um, so we should be okay. I do yellow make brown, but I've decided to start with these colors, so... <laughs> Hopefully that works out okay. Honestly, Nicole, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I'm just kind of going with it. It looks cool. It does look good. I'm actually really, I, I, I worked some of the red through. I started, I did some red and it was like really bold red and I was kind of like worried about that. But um, I worked it through and yeah, I'm a lot happier with what's happening with that. Mine's not here. Yeah. Is that the oh, back? Oh, that That's is so pretty. The back is turning out really like this kind of um, pastel color going on. It's really pretty though. Let's check that out. You know what my problem is? I've watched too much Bob Ross recently. Fuck you, Bob Ross. Fuck why? You. What do you... Do you know who Bob Ross is? Yes, I do. But why because is that a problem? He's... Yes, because he's a master. And he's like, oh, happy little birds. And all of a sudden it looks like magical. So I tried to Bob Ross it, you know, and it just didn't work. This light, light peach. What? I'm just going to squish it. <laughs> See what happens. I'm going to go through 
chromine in the dryer because I don't want to mix my reds with your purples. Good idea. So I'll be right back. So now that we're inside, you can probably see a little bit better the peach kind of colors and the stripes that I was going for. Side is a disaster. <laughs> it's just, it's just, it's bad. It looks like a three-year-old. I like this side. I'll just, this is my first. <laughs>